We all know the Roanoke Valley is a great place to ride a bicycle for transportation and recreation. With over 29 miles of paved greenway, 52 miles of on-road bike lanes, and hundreds of low-speed neighborhood roads to explore, you can get almost anywhere you want to go on a bike. This year, the Virginia General Assembly has passed a new law making it even safer to cycle on Roanoke's roads. These laws affect both drivers and cyclists, so we wanted to take a moment to make sure you knew about these changes. In 2014, Virginia required motor vehicles to pass a bicyclist at three feet. This was a great start, but drivers and cyclists both had a hard time determining what three feet was. Effective July 1st this year, Virginia will require motor vehicles to change lanes when passing cyclists. This is safe for everyone. It gives more room for cyclists and clear direction to motor vehicles in which lane to be in when passing. And remember, it's okay to cross the double yellow line when passing a cyclist, when it's safe. The Roanoke Valley offers some of the most beautiful views in Virginia, so it's not uncommon to come across a group of riders exploring the Commonwealth byways. When riding in a group, Virginia law now allows cyclists to ride two abreast at all times. Previously, the law required cyclists to move single file to let a vehicle pass, but now the cars are required to change lanes when passing, allowing cyclists to remain two abreast, meaning there is actually a shorter distance required to overtake them. Always remember that the Roanoke Valley's roads belong to all users. In addition to good exercise, many of our neighbors rely on bicycles for transportation. The road they're riding may be the only road that takes them to where they need to go. So slow down, be patient, and share the road so we can make sure everyone makes it to their destination.